believe how crowded that store was? <laughs> well, I had my dream prom dress in my hands until somebody kicked me. Oh, it was you? Uh, well, sure, it's easy for you to joke. You guys found great prom dresses. No, they gotta be D. The senior prom is the most important day in a girl's life, next to her wedding day, of mm -hmm. And so far, everything is turning out perfect. I mean, we got the perfect entertainment, John B., the perfect boyfriends to take us, and now we got the perfect prom gowns. Perfect. Oh, and I'm getting perfectly sick. <laughs> to do what's right for you. All I'm saying is I hope you know what you're doing. Of course I do, Maddie. I have made every important outfit that those girls have ever worn, from dance recitals to cheerleading uniforms. Now, they'd never forgive me if I didn't make their prom dresses. Lisa, think back to your senior prom. What's the first thing you remember? Uh, my gown. <laughs> White dotted Swiss daisy applique. And did your mother make it? Heck no. My mama couldn't dress a dinner salad. <laughs> uh, I got it from Neiman's. <laughs> Picked it out myself. It took me six months to save up for that dress. Then why can't Tia and Tamara? Because they got a mama that can sew like a spider. <laughs> Lisa, to your celebrity clients, your gowns may be all that. But to those girls, they're just dresses their mama made. Once I learn how to bead you out of here. <laughs> Mom, we've got really great news. You won't believe what we just bought. Wait, wait, wait. Me first. <laughs> I got something I can't wait to show you. What? Are you ready? <laughs> oh, wow! <laughs> Surprise! I made your prom dresses. Wow. <laughs> well, girls, say something. I'm not hearing anything. <laughs> I'm hearing the sound of you stepping up to the unemployment line. Lisa. <laughs> We're just stunned by their beauty. <laughs> yeah, they're gorgeous. Oh, I knew you'd love them. <laughs> so, now, tell me, what's this exciting thing that you bought? Oh, this bracelet. <laughs> Didn't I buy you one like that for Christmas? Uh, maybe I should take this one back. Yeah, yeah, I better help <laughs> Bye, see you. Now, you see that, Maddie? I told you those girls would be real excited about them. They were excited about getting out of here. Maddie, I know my girls. Now, they couldn't be happier. Oh, I want to die. Our perfect night is ruined. And why did Mom have to go and do something so nice? Oh, they're so beautiful. Now, you see, if they were ugly, we could slam them quick. Yeah. What are we going to do? I mean, uh, we can't hurt her feelings. No, but what about our feelings, Tia? This is our prom, and we already had the perfect dresses. Yeah, which cost a fortune, and we can't return because they were on sale. Dang. Why'd you have to have such a talented and thoughtful mom? Mm. Forget giving our money to the tuck shop. My uncle owns a funeral home. He can hook us up with a couple of black suits. Jay, I'm not wearing no dead man's threads. Uh, come on, Jordan. All the guys are going to be in Texas at the prom. Exactly. Just another way society robs you of your individuality. Well, uh, Jordan, if you don't rent a tux, then you'll be going to the prom as an individual. Herd mentality, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> oh, good. All you guys are here. I want to talk to you about prom night. No, don't worry, Ray. We'll behave ourselves. Well, actually, I want to talk to you about the limousine situation. But since you brought up your baby... Uh, let's talk limos. <laughs> well, I know how special you are prom night. Do <laughs> that, Dad. Right, right. <laughs> and anyone can ride to the prom in a black limo. So I was thinking, I'm going to give you an upgrade. A white stretch limo. Ray, I hope you're not talking about Moby Dick. Moby Dick? The old white clunker that nobody wants? That limo is a classic. It's so classic, Superfly's still sitting in the back. We'll take it. Thanks, Dad. What? I knew my baby would appreciate my generous offer. And to show you that my heart's in the right place, I'm going to give you my favorite driver. 
Man, I hope you're not talking about old Eddie. Well, he's never had a ticket. He never drives over 35. <laughs> well, then, I'll drive oh, you guys. Ray, I was just, I was just tripping, right? You know, I, I love Eddie, okay? <laughs> Good. Are you out of your mind? Do you know what that limo looks like? Yes. It's funky and old and has a huge back seat. Big enough for two girls to change prom dresses in. Huh? Sister, you are a genius. Y'all want to fill in a confused. You see, we can wear Lisa's dresses out of the house, but take them off in the limo and change into our dresses for the prom. Mom doesn't get her feelings hurt, and we get to wear the dresses we buy. What are they talking about, Don? I don't know. Something about taking off their dresses in the limo. I'm with it. <laughs> yeah, well, you're gonna be with it sitting up front with old Eddie. <laughs> you see, this is what I'm talking about. I'm not paying all this money to look like a penguin. <laughs> Man, what are you saying? You look fine. Yeah? And <laughs> hey, put your pants on, dog. Put your pants on. Put your pants on. <laughs> Tripping about Hi. I'm Dina. Oh, and don't you look good in that tux. <laughs> well, Dina, I'm not feeling this one, okay? <laughs> You're right. It isn't working. Mm. And I'm not going to try to snow a smooth brother like you. Good, because you can't. <laughs> Well, that's obvious. See, you're a man with a lot of style. <laughs> Does it show? <laughs> well, your smile alone is worth a million dollars. Now, how are you going to wear a $39 tux? <laughs> See, that's all I'm saying, Dean. <laughs> uh, tell you what. Why don't you slip out of the little boy's prom tux and I'll bring out our designer line from the back. Well, let's get a little Armani up in here. <laughs> yes, sir. A man with your impeccable taste will be much happier with our high-end line. High-end. Now, that's me all day. <laughs> Maddie, don't put that cheap Instamatic on my tripod. Down in front, I'm trying to focus. <laughs> Flash cubes? They still make those? Use them one, ain't I? <laughs> All right, get ready, get ready. Here comes the prom queen. <laughs> Break it out the way. You block a Maddie shot. Me? I'll remind you that I'm the one with a 35 millimeter SLR autofocus wide angle sports cam. You also got your wide angle butt in my shot. <laughs> oh, wait till you see our girls. Oh, they look so beautiful. Oh, you'd swear it was me going to the prom. <laughs> hey, look at our babies. The babies, they're stunning young women. Did windbreakers come with those dresses? If not, I've got a couple pullover sweaters. No, thanks, Dad. Are the guys here yet? Oh, forget about them. We've got to take some pictures of our beautiful girls in their beautiful dresses that I made. <laughs> Go ahead, y'all. Get the snack. Oh, man. Don't tell me my batteries are dead. <laughs> I've been saying that since the day I met you. <laughs> Just shut up and switch cubes. <laughs> Ain't got nothing on you. <laughs> Dina, huh? You know it. <laughs> <laughs> well, look at you. You look like the angel on top of a Christmas tree. Thanks. <laughs> and you look like the guy on top of a wedding cake. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? See, you really work in that dress. Oh, thanks. <laughs> well, you know, this will look even better on my other. Wrist. <laughs> well, um, we better get going. Uh, we want to make a big entrance with these great dresses. Yeah. Oh, ooh, hold it, hold it. Group shot. Uh, you want me to get this one ready? <laughs> Just take the picture. Clara, help. Hey, man, 
Something's wrong with my dress. Uh, turn on the light. Where is it? Right there. Oh. <laughs> Oops, I've got my leg in the armhole. When I was your age, we used to ride in the back with the girl. Don't ask, Eddie. Roll <laughs> <gasps> ah! up that window now! Boy, you want to live to see the prom? Roll up the window! And keep it up! Go on. Now I see why are you riding up front. You too. Ooh, I wish we had a full-length mirror. Well, I'll just lie down on the floor and you can look at me. <laughs> oh, boy, you look even more beautiful than before. Aw, oh, thanks. That's so sweet. Face it, Tyreek. We're taking the four best-dressed girls to the prom. <laughs> It's not gonna be perfect or what? Hey guys, we're here just in time. Jumpy's about to go on. Uh, hold up, you know this prom is so overrated. Why don't we go to the movies instead? Girl, are you bugging? I want to show off my dress. Yes, yeah, honey. Me. Me. They've been seen. <laughs> so, y'all ready to get your groove out? <laughs> no. I'm ready to get my groove out. Excuse me, sir. What's wrong? Our perfect prom night is ruined. We cannot wear these gowns in there. Yeah, why not? Everyone else is. <laughs> exactly. Guys, we've waited 17 years for this night, and we are not going in there looking like members of the prom drill team. Quick, buddy. Okay. All we have to do is change into the dresses Mom made us. Right. <laughs> oh, thank goodness you have a talented and thoughtful mom. Look, let's go find Moby Dick. Go. There she blows. <gasps> what? It's locked! Oh, you know no dad would give us a responsible driver? What are we supposed to do? Stand around out here and wait for Eddie? Yeah, yeah. Unless you can pull him out of your hat. <laughs> Open. 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 Here you guys are. John B. is blowing it up. Come on back. Forget the dress thing. Yeah. Are all of you guys in some kind of club or something? Stephen, chill, chill. Now look, okay, I feel for you, all right? And you're my girls, so I'm gonna hang with you. Out here in the parking lot, in the cold, on our senior prom night. Thanks. Thanks. Right after John B. finishes singing. Come on, Stephen, I want to get up. Right behind you, baby. You know, I've worked on this car a thousand times. I can get us in. You think you can? Yeah, yeah. I, I just need a like a coat hanger. We've got hangers yeah. on our dresses. Yeah, in the car. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, yeah. okay. Uh, we can use George's little coat hanger arms. Listen, I'll pry the window open a crack. Uh, uh, then you reach in and pull it all the way down. Hey, I've been working out. <laughs> just do it. You know, my arm might not fit up in there. Just do it. <laughs> All right, you got it? Yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. Ah! Plus, I'm sad I'm missing the prom. Uh -huh. <laughs> Look like to me, you was trying to hide by the car. No, 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 no. I was just trying to disarm the alarm. <laughs> Wait a minute, that ain't come out right. Look, 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 officer. This is our limo. We're trying to get our prom dresses out. 
Uh-huh, that's funny. Look like y'all wearing prom dresses. No, 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 we need to get our other prom dresses. Yeah, yeah, they're locked in the car. Oh, yeah, yeah, I get it, I get it. Your backup prom dresses that all the girls bring. Oh, no, my fingers are turning purple. Alpha face, this is Omega, too. Huh? It's Harry. <laughs> Look, I've apprehended four juvenile suspects on a possible R325. Request backup. What? Some kids was trying to break into a limo. Call the cops. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that right cross? Oh, you knocked him out. I love hockey. <laughs> Didn't our girls look beautiful in my gown? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And Tyreek and Joy, they look nice, too. Mm, such a nice boys. Every parent's dream. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you use your stick tripping. <laughs> and I don't know which boyfriend I like more. They're both such a blessing. Yeah, yeah, real blessing. Hit him again. Are you ignoring me? I'm trying to, but you keep talking. <laughs> Yellow. Police. The police? Give me the phone. Well, what happened? What happened? Are you kidding me? How could that have happened? What happened? What happened? No, it's not a TV, and I can't turn her down. We'll be right there. Are you going to tell me what happened, or am I going to have to hit star 69? Cops busted T and Tamara for breaking into a car. Huh? It's those rotten little boys. Oh, I knew they were no good the minute I laid eyes on their bald little heads. Get the coach. Get you. Listen, officer, I would love to give you my parents' phone number. You know, I'm honest. But see, the, the, the pain's blocking my memory right now. Look, my fingers are starting to glow. Yeah, yeah, step aside. My baby! My baby! Don't you worry, Mama! Oh, no! We're not wearing her dresses! My girls are innocent! It's those rotten boys! They did! Yeah. I'm Lisa Landry, and that is my daughter! you trying to drag off to jail. No one's going anywhere. I'm just trying to get to the bottom of this. Uh, maybe I can help, officer. I'm, I'm uh, Ray Campbell. Yes. This is my limousine, and uh, that's my daughter hiding behind it. OK. Now, who's claiming these two thieves? Well, one of those thieves works for me. The other one with the fat fingers, well, that's my daughter's boyfriend. You don't know my fame, Mr. Campbell. And I don't want to. <laughs> officer, I think we can handle it. Yeah? Then everything's OK? OK. No, it is not OK. Everything's fine, officer. Thanks for coming out. You know, I was out here first, technically, as my cop. Mom, I can explain. See, Tamir and I, we, we loved your dresses, but we had already bought our own prom gowns. We should have told you before, but we didn't want to hurt your feelings, so we changed in the limo. Oh, I hate this. Because we went behind your back? No, because Maddie was right. Oh, there'll be no living with her now. Lisa, we are so sorry. Mom, we wouldn't hurt you for anything. Girls, girls. No, you got nothing to be sorry for. Now, it is your big night, okay? <laughs> and you should be able to wear just whatever you want. And the dresses you picked out, well, they're beautiful. They're really, they look lovely on you. Yeah, and they look lovely on the other 12 girls who are wearing them, too. Oh, uh, you can't go back in there. What? Oh, don't worry, don't worry, girls. Now, Mama will not let anything spoil your perfect night. Don't worry. <laughs> Ray, open the car door. What for? Because we got to get our girls out of these tacky off the racks and into some Lisa Landry. <laughs> Bad. <laughs> oh, baby, yours doesn't look all that bad. You are so lucky you're fine. <laughs> Thanks, baby. All right, y'all. Now we're going to slow it down a little bit. Let you guys catch your breath. Check it out.
Well, as long as we're here, we might as well dance. Well, I guess one dance won't hurt. Should I leave? You always do. 